Using a wireless headphone for working out has become all the rage, and this is the Blue Ant Pump, a $130 Bluetooth sports model. It comes in a few different colors, including this green one that has a transparent housing. Hi, I'm David Carnoy, and let me tell you first what I like about the pump. For starters, it seems durable and is totally waterproof, so long as you have the gasket in place covering the micro USB charging port. While Bluetooth doesn't transmit underwater, you could wear these in the pool if you keep your head above water. They also have up to a 100 foot range, which is more than the typical 30 feet that Bluetooth offers, and battery life is decent enough at around eight hours. The headphone's housing has a nice soft to the touch feel to its finish, and the controls are well placed in the right earpiece and can be operated blindly. The play pause button doubles as an answer end button, and the volume controls double as transport controls, allowing you to skip tracks forward and back by double tapping them. A microphone is built into the unit, which allows you to use this as a stereo headset for making calls. The pump is an in-ear headphone, and the tips are designed to be really jammed into your ears to get a tight seal. You do get various ear tips, including a foam set that allows more sound to penetrate so you can hear traffic around you when you're running or biking. And Blue Ant also provides these little snap-on stabilizers, which help keep the buds securely in your ears. Overall, I thought the headphones fit well and didn't move around at all when I used them on a treadmill in the gym. However, I did need to use the stabilizers to get a tight seal, and at times the top of the stabilizers dug into my ears a little. I thought it would have been nice had Blue Ant gone with a slightly less rigid rubber. If you do get a tight seal, there's plenty of bass, but the headphone just doesn't sound all that clear or refined. I preferred the more natural sound of the Plantronics Backbeat Fit, but that model does have an open design and lets in more ambient noise for safety reasons. All in all, while the pump has a few shortcomings, it's an appealing wireless sports headphone that should work well for a lot of people. Ideally, it would cost a little less than its list price of $130, but hopefully it will come down in price over time. I'm David Carnoy, and that's the Blue Ant Pump. Thanks for watching.